Where's Lucky? Cafeteria. How's Laura? Uh, she's going in and out. But she recognized me, and that's good news. She, uh, she also asked me to tell you not to worry about her and that she loves you. Luke, no, no. I have to be with my wife. But they're not going to let you in. They can't stop me! Luke, is that what you really want to do? Do you want to cause some kind of disturbance that might distract the team of physicians treating your wife? Now, if Laura... Bobby will come get you if it's necessary. You can say it, Tony. If she dies... I'm willing that's not going to happen. Hey, God has nothing to do with this. You know that. It's all arbitrary. Terrible things happen to people all the time. You said so yourself. It's random. There's no rhyme, no reason. Well, I don't agree with that. At least not the rhyme or reason part. I believe that we're all, th all out there. We're blindly, inexorably fulfilling our destinies. No, what we are is trapped in a cage like rats. There's no reason for my wife to be in there fighting for her life. Well, Luke, maybe the sense-making comes on a different plane. At least that's what I found myself choosing to believe. Because I don't think I could put one foot in front of the other one if I didn't think there was a reason for the terrible things that we sometimes have to endure. If you're right, if it's Laura's destiny to die over something so s senseless, then I don't want to be in a world that is that skewed. But your options are not that simple anymore. You've got Lucky, and you've got a new baby to think about, you know? And if worse comes to worse, you will get through it. For them, you have no choice in this. Sometimes I think it's better not to invest in people. They leave. And it's scary. But I think the alternative's worse. And I'm not gonna try to convince you that BJ's loss made a better person out of me because I am a bitter and I'm an angry man. And sometimes it still hurts so bad in me that I can't take a breath. But Luke, the thought of never having had BJ in my life, now that is truly unbearable. And Lucas, he needs me now more than ever. Do you know that he sometimes comes into BJ's room in the middle of the night expecting to suddenly find her back again, like some present under the Christmas tree? I mean, life is horrific. And that is a granted. But we, we muddle through somehow for the sake of the children. 